Ladies and gentlemen, you're overhearing this. Norm was talking about. I faced off with the creator of this planet a long time ago, and you're going to overhear it. That's what living's about: facing off with your maker publicly and let her out, let her rip. Especially when you reach really close to the grave. Job's wife was quite right, quite right. Curse the Lord and die. So I know I ought to ride a bicycle. That ain't long. Yeah, it gets, comes close every day. There's enough people who kill me. All I gotta do is re overhear me, remind them that they're idiots and they'll come stalking me. I won't live long. I'll curse the Lord and die. That's what they need to be doing over there in the Middle East right now. Instead of walking into squares and blowing themselves up, you know, listen to Job's wife, you idiot. Curse the Lord publicly and die. Go on! You go to in Syria, start cursing the Lord publicly. Everybody will pull your arms off. Everybody will rip your cells out of your, out of your body. You won't have any cells left. And there are cannibals there. They'll eat you. Do you think they ate the body of Muammar Gaddafi? I bet they did. I bet the Libyans that killed him cut up his body and ate it. What do you want to bet? Anybody that would do that to Muammar Gaddafi is surely lower slimy enough as a human being. You fed your children that body, didn't you? You scum! You roasted Muammar Gaddafi's body in Libya and ate it. And the hell you didn't. I don't care what you told me. I know what you did. You're scum. You did everything scum do. Molest your children. You attack your children's mind with everything except the crotch. And they never get to play with their crotch. You do worse to their mind, you parasitical zombie dork. You live in Libya. You're a parasitical piece of crap of a human. Die, Olivia! Turn blue, Olivia, for God's sake! Die and set a nice example! Go on! Do something nice for the planet! Every one of you citizens, do this till you die! Go on! Pile of crap, Olivia! Shame you, I sit over here, a monarch and isolated God in the United States! I'm not on my native soil! My maker's heart! I could just get to my native soil. My dream chamber of my maker. That's my native soil. I came from a very blissful pool there. And the Lord called me out for this task. And then got my way! With eyeballs, breath, everything about this place. In my way! Everything about it is the stupidity of the Lord. And I'm here to cause you a nice day. And I'm not able to do it! I'll eat your maker. I want you to look what's going to happen to you. See this throat? You're going to go down it. Ready? Wow! I just ate shit. That's what I'm real good at doing. I like to eat shit. I've been told to eat shit all my life. Somehow intelligence tilted. Okay. I'll find all the living in its maker's dream chamber and eat it. Sounds good to me. Yum, yum. Eat them up. Now I want you to see me. I'm Uncle George and the Little Rascals. <laughs> no, no, beat him up. No, no, beat him up. <laughs> and they keep shooting me with this damn Roman candle. Ow, no, no, beat him up. Jerome keeps shooting me in the butt with a Roman candle. <gasps> no, no, beat him up. Damn Jerome.